Ladies and gentlemen, boys, girls, and MBs, I've been working on a thing for some time now, okay? For a while now, we've been, we've been trying to, I've been trying to do some shit, okay? I've been doing some shit. And that is... Seven months. Almost there for the nine-month aneurysm. It's a new podcast called The Leftovers. That's right! Your boy, WFT, is um, working with the H3H3 Productions crew. We have a new podcast called Leftovers. No, it's not merch. Merch is coming. Merch is on its way, but go pump, go and blast this. New episode is dropping. I don't know if they dropped the whole, I don't know if they dropped the actual like podcast okay. yet. But cats out of the bag, boys. I thought the news was that you were going to get your computer upgraded so they could play games. I am. Linus is making my new computer right now as we speak. Yes. Oh, they uploaded the whole thing. You. Welcome everybody! To the leftovers! The wait is over! That's right. With me, welcoming to the H3 family and our $3 million set. We spared no expense, Hassan Piker. Thank you. Thank you for thank you for having me. Thank you. I'm ready to Okay. We plugged you too. Go ahead and show us his socials again. I'm ready to uh, see that. Oh, we'll look at that. You. Hell yeah. I, I, mm -hmm. I'm ready to I'm ready to bring the patriotic voice to this That's what this godless is. channel. Thank you. Hey, come on. That's that's what I'm here for. That's right. <laughs> Real American voices will be heard finally. What is the leftovers? Listen, I've had enough of you guys complaining that I yes. you don't want me to talk about politics. So You I look so nervous. Oh, dude, uh, the first, like, I would say the first 30 minutes, I'm, like, a little nervous. But then after that, I, uh, I got, like, super, super uh, comfy. They're so awesome, dude. Like, I love the crew so much. Uh, Ethan and I, what, don't want you to hear us on? You want the views on the video? Bro, are you crazy? Watching it here One literally so gives more views. I'm not going to watch the whole thing. Damn, I saw someone in the subreddit to call this shit when Frenemies ended. So, I already love Ethan. I think, like, we've done a couple oh stuff together to where it was like we were vibing real well. And, you know, he reached out to me with the opportunity. And I was like, you know what? I think that could be fucking great. And uh, their crew is fucking sick. Seven like, I love, I love everything they're doing. Um, I really never tweet out the photo from the Insta. The tweet will bang. Oh yeah, I'm gonna do that. Hold on, uh, I'm gonna do that right now. Um, but yeah, I, love the collab with uh, I think it's gonna be wonderful. Like the first episode was awesome. Like I had so much fucking fun, despite the fact that you know I was doing it late at night. And doing OMG, it this is for, so awesome um, you know, we, you guys we went for like cast. three hours. It was supposed to be, so the podcast was supposed to actually be for, uh, what do you call it? I stole my the podcast was supposed to be for, for, you know, two hours from like seven to nine, we were going to shoot. And then we fucking shot to like 1130. You know what I mean? 11 fucking 30. Glad to see you enthusiastic. Love to you, Hussein. Beer and Malding is still going. Would you be collaborating with Trisha too? I don't know who Trisha Paytas is. And I also uh, wish to keep it that way for the record. Like, I don't, I, I don't know any of that side of the world. Like, I don't know anything about like YouTube stuff. You know what I mean? Like YouTube drama, things like that. 
I don't want to know. Do not come. Okay. Will it be on Spotify? I don't know where creators. it will be on. Am they're they're just like kind of this is basically a continuation. Um, this is basically a continuation of like some of the many podcasts that H three H Productions has. This is now their uh, you know newest podcast uh, where Ethan and I will leftovers like you ever. Had Ethan and I will be uh, you know doing a podcast recover you know some of the new stuff that's going on because apparently, and I did not even know this like. Apparently, there's a lot of people in Ethan's community that were like, yo, you should stop talking about politics. <laughs> they were like, you should stop talking about politics. So he was like, yeah, that's, that's right. I'm going to talk about politics then. I'm going to do a whole ass fucking politics podcast. <laughs> and obviously, it's awesome opportunity. Like, it's, it's sick. And like I said, I can't stress this enough. Like, I love the crew, man. They're so dope. And Ethan, too, obviously. So, they said that because they uh, disagreed with him. And the new host is, what is this? Oh, shit. Thank you for the being. The Let's just hope he doesn't end up happen. marrying someone in the Klein family. Now, nah, the show will end in one of them finding out there's an arrest warrant out for them while live. What the fuck? What does that even mean? I'm fangirling so hard. I'm so happy. It's the song. The fucking set's insane. Dude, that's right. That is a $3 billion bunker, dude. We're in a $3 billion bunker. Leaving so your shit stream podcast. to go watch Hassan somewhere else. Lamau. What? Have you seen Austria's second largest city? We'll have a communist mayor from Austria's communist party. Uh, no, I did not know that, but... He was in the wrong chat. Oh. So. So that's what's going on. Yeah, we're going we're gonna to start shilling protein survival buckets. We got. We got, you know, I, I'm, I'm holding up one of those bug zappers and so is he. Because there's a lot of flies everywhere in Los Angeles. It's crazy. Your H3, H3 video is demonetized. Wait, what? Pago Palomarade? Oh, shit. Welcome, Pago Palam Raid, uh, Soy Raiders. Welcome, welcome, welcome to the Hasanabi broadcast. Uh, you know, shit camp is starting. There's so much going on. I just announced my, uh, I just announced my podcast with uh, Ethan Klein. That's right. Love you, Hassan. H3, H3 Productions has a new podcast called The Leftovers. And, um... You know, I, I feel like it's going to be a lot of fun. The podcast, Hassan Hassel. I was watching breakfast cooking. First of all, they were not breakfast cooking this morning. As a matter of fact, Pago Palom was driving around. Well, Malena was driving Pago Palom and Casey Tron and uh, Just the Minx around. Because they were doing the comedians in cars getting coffee. So, dude, so much just occurred in, in a matter, in a time frame of like a few seconds. Like, we got a big raid. We got a big uh, news reveal. People All hang. of it is happening at the same time. I'm just gonna wait. Hold on one second. I was reading the uh, I was reading the H3H2 Productions subreddit, and like, and you know, it, it was definitely there were some mixed reviews because I posted the couch thing last night. Some of you don't know what that is, obviously. Bro, you was so high. No, I was not high at all. Ethan got big in the anti hw era, and Sin says reform, but some of his old old fans hate his new politics. Yeah, I know, but it doesn't matter. Um, but I was reading the, cause I posted hey, the couch, Chapman, like his, time have I asked him, I was like, asked. we should tease this, right? Like we should, you know, we should give like a little bait to the fans. So they freak out. Cause I've been holding this like close to the chest and, uh, you know, keeping it a secret for the longest time. Right. Here you go. Blast this out too. I, I tweeted it. The cat's out of the bag. Is that that's the common term, right? Ajan, Pogo. Dude, look at this micromanager Andes, bro. Look at this. Do you see this? This is what happens when you have thirty thousand micromanagers. I love this new project, but will this take time away from stream? Let's go chat. Like, okay, bro. 
Like you pay me literally two cents an hour over the course of an entire year, okay? How about you fucking calm down, brother? Almost one year. I went and made a whole fucking show about it. <laughs> but the spirit of this show is not serious policy debate. It is bringing righteous justice to these shit bags. That's it. Okay. Just clowning I mean, on idiots. I love that. Yeah. I'm I'm a fan. I mean, that's what I do regularly. So when you hit me up, I mean, when we did that original uh, podcast, your podcast, yeah. I was like, this is, is this a thing? Like, are we, <laughs> are we vibing right now? Right. And, you know, and then after that, we, we, uh. Ten we covered the Gamba stuff, and I was like, podcasts. okay, we're, we're yeah, that was vibing. Yeah. We're vibing pretty hard. Well, I'm a fan. I always watch your I – don't, I don't catch the streams. I think you're psychotic, by the way. You stream, like, every yeah. fu every oh, day. Lord, so every day. You take the weekend off together. or something, nope, bro? Like, you I, gotta, mean, I took hard, today off, kind hard. of. Seems a little – it's a little capitalistic, if you ask me. Yeah, <laughs> working, working hard. seven is, days a week? Working eight. Eight days a week. Oh, shit. Project. Yeah, that's right. I put an extra day in there. The Cranked it up to 11. That's right. I mean, I'm I'm doing like eight hours every day minimum, and that's like lower now. But that's mostly because like Can't I just I have nothing going on. Yeah, I feel that. You know what I mean? I just I it's what I love doing. Well, God so. bless, dude. They say if you work at it, if you love what you do, you work a day. You don't work a day. Something like that. That's it doesn't it doesn't feel like real there's some on the camera they pointed at you yeah a gun dude yo but um just now there was a recount in iceland and the women aren't majority anymore because like nine votes went into the wrong pill what okay bro who cares i'm sorry Thank you for informing me, though. Like, thank you for the update about Iceland uh, and and how nine votes were able to change the majority the ultimate crossover majority podcast. female parliament, dude. One That's right. Hope I'm very fucking excited. I'm coping. I'm really excited. We got shit camp coming up. We got you know the new podcast. Like, there's so much happening, dude. So much. Oh, Soda was on a radio me, not NMP Law. Thank you, Soda, for the raid. Micromanaging Marvin's in the chat. That's right, dude. Nine percent, nine votes are like twenty-five percent swing in Iceland. Yeah, I know. Hassan, did you know you're on the new H3 podcast? Wait, what? Shut up. That's not true. No way. That's gone. I know I should post here a lot, but big congratulations on all this. Yeah, I think this is going to be wonderful. It's going to be fun as fuck. Work, you know what I mean? It's just, I I mean, you know, you do I was, this for fun too. You yeah, look at I like mean, dumb there, idiots on the internet such. on a regular basis. There was a point when I was doing like the weekly videos where it was turned into such a fucking grind. But that, since we were able to pivot pivot to doing the podcast with all these the guys and New everyone podcast, here that I love the uh, it does feel like a joy rest. and a pleasure and this to me I want to say I think there are some people are going to be freaked out by this format they're going to say I hate politics too much testosterone whatever yeah, well, I'm sure leave your they're complaint gonna say, they're going to say too much testosterone I think some people will say that really because there's a lot of people that are think we're you know like the female male dynamic that I have with Trisha oh true but I just, I could not, I mean, I, ra I, I don't know, for me and everyone here, we were- This motherfucker really has three mugs, by the way. That's not even a joke. That's not a meme. Homie straight up has foggies. three mugs. I mean, I had, I had coffee and, and uh, you know, Coke Zero, but he was just straight ripping three mugs, dude. Oh, Incredible God. stuff. I've never seen something like this. I mean, the performance was, was through the roof, dude. How often is the podcast? Once a week. My Keith is so jealous. Oh, dude, the you guys want to know? Okay, we're obviously not gonna watch all of it because I mean, there's a lot of fun. We went through like the Gen Z TikTok stuff that was hilarious. I I would say like I got into the groove after we started like covering the news a little bit. Like the intro, I was like a little uncomfortable, but then um. The intro, I was like a little, like I was, you know, trying to see like, how do I fit in here? Because 
I have been communicating with Ethan for a while now, and you know, I've talked to him a bunch on camera and stuff. But it's always different when you're like in the room, and I was like, shit, like, how, how are, are we are we gonna like how are we gonna make this work a little bit? Like, I was a little nervous, but it, it, I think it worked out really well. I I think we're just like, um, we we got into the groove so immediately. You know what I mean? You seem super pumped about it. I'm sure it's going to be awesome. Twenty minutes in, and he's only watched three minutes of the vid. Oh, the one thing I will say though, we both pause like crazy we are we are pause both of us are massive pausers dude like and and incredibly adhd so like it, that is actually the it the hardest part time. of this <laughs> this broadcast is gonna be like you know staying on track and there's a massive crew there and they're all so dope Pugger. right and and like without them, I have no. I don't think there it, this would ever work. You know, without them, like fucking keeping it on track a little bit. And Ethan does a pretty good job of keeping shit Hammies, on track jammies, too. But like, can't quite what happened to Sammy's hammies jammies. Can't quite what happened to Sammy's hammies. Y'all could probably watch a six second TikTok vid and go on a two hour tangent. That's literally what we did. We're thinking like mm -mm -mm. I, we just kept thinking Hassan Piker. Well, I'm you on. and the Turk. Yeah. Can That's... you forgive me? I actually, we thought for a second, and then we quickly corrected ourselves, but we were like Jew and Arab, and we're like, Turks aren't Arab, so. Yeah, just, I, that'll first you the Turks. I didn't say, I was just, I almost, yeah. but I did the research, and we came back strong. Well, I'm, I'm Muslim, so, you know. Right. You got that, but Turk. I didn't say Muslim, I said Arab. No, no I know, I'm saying, right. well, you're Jewish, See, I'm now Muslim. Now you're assuming, now you fucked up. Wait, why? Because not all Arabs are Muslim, Hassan. No, I know, but I'm oh, saying okay. I'm, you're okay. Jewish, I'm Muslim, so all know, right. There's that right. at least, kind of. I right. mean, I'm the worst Muslim. Yeah, I'm the worst <laughs> Jew. So we have that in common. Say, yeah, yeah, I'm totally. So we have that. We have a lot in common. Yeah. We do. <laughs> um, I'm gonna let I, you people, lead. People, people thirst trap over me. Yeah, people exactly. thirst trap over you. I, they don't really, but. Not anymore. Not since the barbs uh, came after me. The what? The barbs. The barbs. Are you unfamiliar with what the barbs are? No. What is that? The every stand culture group on the internet has like their own little name. Mm -hmm. Nicki Minaj's fans call themselves the barbs. Oh the oh the bar oh yeah I, of course I followed your beef with the I didn't know they were yeah. the bar why the barbs they just call themselves the bar I think Barbie maybe I don't know Bar oh my God I'm so sorry please don't dox me. <laughs> Please, I'm so sorry. <laughs> well, you know, <laughs> for those who don't know what Hassan's talking about, he got into a public spat with Mickey Minaj. Mickey. Oh, it, it's all Because she's okay. a mouse. He, he said Mickey. <laughs> Mickey Minaj, because she's a fucking Disney mouse. Oh, no, it's over. Got him. We're, we're, we're literally canceled already. I, dude, trust episode. me, I've been canceled by K-pop stands. Literally nothing could ever hold a candle to that. I'm going to be honest with you. I feel like barbs are... Barbs? They're, they're vicious. So have we found the Trinidad, Trinidad swollen, bald gentleman yet? Have no. we located him? No, the health minister looked all around, and they just they couldn't find him. <laughs> Pull up that clip, Dan. Let's start Do you like there. having a crew that's able to react here, or is it kind of weird? No, it's sick. Especially because, like, I know... Especially because, I like, I know that all those dudes, like, they watch. 100%. They're like... Like, a lot of the people in, in uh, Ethan's crew, they're, like, they're... I, I don't know if they're, like, full-time Hasanabi heads, but, like, I can tell when someone is like-minded. You know what I mean? And I know for a fact because, like, the, the content that they had lined yeah. up and that they'd produced ahead of time was, like, so perfectly in line with, like, everything I talk about. It was so... I mean, I don't know how to describe it, dude. It was like, it was perfect. It was seamless. How are you shorter than Ethan on that vid? Second bait try? Yeah, Ethan is actually 6'9", dude. Yeah, there's like, there's definitely some homies there that are like very left. You know what I mean? It's almost like a Hassan, another Hassan stream. It's like a better Hassan stream. It's, it's great. The real question is, cause he popularized on the set, dude. You know I'm not gonna go. 
an entire broadcast i'm mentioning cussy dude yes there is a cussy mention in the fucking in the pod you guys are just gonna have to watch okay i'm gonna skip through some of the stuff so but like we cussy. covered the tucker carlson stuff like the you know the barbs that's what that's what we like spent a while talking about uh this is my first ever email or not the first one there's another email i sent to ethan like years ago even before this but this was like the first official email i sent to him i think I don't want to spoil it. You guys got to watch it on your own, dude. It's it's really good. Yeah, I said what up to him in a fucking email. Shut up, dude. Shut up. Shut up. Shut up. Yeah. It's hey, coming. if you like this video, please subscribe and hit that bell so you don't miss out on any future videos. <laughs>